Anyways, uh, Pete and I were watching television the other night. And, uh, thank you. Thanks. Yeah. Have you seen this Unsolved Mysteries? Unsolved Mysteries? Robert Stack's somebody that needs to calm down, isn't he? <laughs> oh. This guy is not the guy you want to be around when you lose your car keys, you know? He's just so intense. Hey, Bob, have you seen my keys? July 18th, 1998. 7.45 p.m. The comedy team of Pete and James lose their car keys. Where did they go? And would anyone ever see them again? It's all right, Bob. I found them. Update. We're the comedy team of Pete and James. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. You, you knew it was ev inevitable that somebody was going to start whispering in his ear and he was going to move on and, um, you know, become a solo star. That's it. Jacob is his owner. We wish you the best of luck. We really do. What did you do? Come on. Please. If right. they were doing a movie about Pete and James, mm -hmm. I would probably get the Pete role. No, so no, there's saying, no way, no way. I'm saying because he was taller. We did uh, the Laugh House, the Comedy Band, Giggles, Chuckle Hut, uh, Guffaws. Uh, we did Ha Ha's, He He's, He Ha's, Ho Ho's, uh, Funny Bones, The Funny Farm, uh, Senior McFunnies, The Laugh Plate, uh, Comedy Corner, Comedy Cellar, Comedy Alley, Comedy Attic, Comedy Corral, Comedy Kitchen. Jeff's. I need gigs. I need to get some more gigs. We need to, you know, the tour was canceled. So I need to get some gigs. Um, jobs. Jobs? Jobs. I need to get some jobs. Oh, gigs means jobs. Yeah. Right. Okay. That's now, hold on one second, because I should, uh, I should probably write that down. So Pete and I were, uh, I was, um, I was watching TV the other day, and, um, and uh, have you seen Unsolved Mysteries? Yeah? You know, uh, Robert Stack is somebody that needs to calm down, isn't he? <laughs> NBC announced today the signing of its newest highly touted sitcom star, Pete. Discovered as a rising talent on the stand-up comedy scene, he was part of that team. Remember, who was that other guy? I don't know. Oh, well, right. all four major networks. You've never heard of a no-win situation? Vietnam? This? Who's that? That's Albert Brooks. Who's that? Al Albert Brooks. Larry? Yeah. What are you doing? I'm sorry, I just didn't recognize the voice right it's away. Albert Brooks, filmmaker, Albert Brooks. Right, I'm sorry. You know, I'm, I'm in the middle of that. I know, I just didn't hear the voice right. I, I'm, I'm the only one in here right now anyway, so. Keep, really? keep going, you're doing great. I, I think Is it okay? Oh, it works. It works. There's no Pete here. You know, he actually, there's no Pete here. He's like five feet behind. I, I don't know what you're talking about. That's not Pete. I'll uh, call his name and we'll see if he, he, he says anything. Uh, Pete, is that you? Pete? Hey, Pete. 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 That's not Pete. Uh, Bill. Bill. All right, I'll see you at lunch. That's just Bill. So what are you, what are you, what are you working on? The pilot for NBC. You know, they ordered like 13 episodes. It's sort of like a cheers meets, I don't know, evening at the improv kind of thing. Like stand-up. Oh, yeah. Every week, every week there's going to be a different stand-up comedian. We don't want somebody that's overexposed. This could be something good for me, then. I don't You know, I don't forget about you. You're so... You're so talented. You ever watch The Unsolved Mysteries? Yeah. No, no. so you don't... You don't respond. Oh, okay. That, the audience will do that. Robert Sachs, somebody that needs to calm down, isn't he? You know, I mean, it's like, this is not the guy you want to be around when you lose your car keys. You know, it'd be like, Hey, Bob, have you seen my keys? July? No, okay, so don't. I know what you're going to say. I, I appreciate that it's funny, but you, you're not supposed to laugh. Why are we here? Why am I sitting here? Why am I putting up with this? Why am I listening to you? Franklin said, you know, we should talk. And, uh, and, and you know, I want to buy your groceries. I, you know what I'm saying? No, I don't. I want to buy your groceries. 7.46 p.m. 